birthday is back with another video for you to watch with your sisters and brothers. Enjoy the presents while they sit up and talk over my banks. So please slide up and come and let me know what you think. That boy is Benny Hanna. We ready to eat. I'm hungry. I ain't got a lot of time. Let's go. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Before we get started, if you would please subscribe, hit the notification bell so you know every time we post a new video. I didn't say where I'm work this time, y'all. So guys, today we have some of my favorite things. We have crawfish, green mussels, boudin balls. I have Tabasco wings, we have fries, and Koo has garlic parmesan. Garlic parm. Garlic parm. Let's pray and get to eat. All right, Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this meal, God. We thank you for your love. We ask that you just bless this meal. Bless the hands that prepared this meal. Let's eat. In Jesus' name we pray. <laughs> Amen. 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 <laughs> Y'all, I'm drinking ginger ale today. <laughs> Gotta have something to push all that food down. And since I'm back in the gym, I'm on some water. So I might have to give me a little sip of ginger ale to but you know, I might not even eat a little, a lot today. All right, what do I want to start? I'm gonna start with a crawfish. Mm. Happy Friday, everyone! Look at that. Woo! What they spicy? Oh, baby! Oh, see that? Nice and red. Oh, we have some sauce on the side right here too, y'all. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Ooh. I got these Louisiana style. Mm. Well, I got the crawfish Louisiana style. And I got the mussels uh garlic sensation. Mm -hmm. So it has some sauce at the bottom. Wings is right too. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, that's so good. All right, y'all. I'm gonna try a green lemon. I'm trying to get some of that juice that's down here. Mm. Y'all see that? All the good garlic on there. Let me grab some more. Oh, we didn't do a thumbnail. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. 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 Good All right. We'll be right back. And we're back. <laughs> mm. Magical TV. I want to send a special shout out to one of my player partner pimps, Super Ken. What's up, <laughs> Super Ken? <laughs> hey, Ken. Hey, comment down below, Super Ken. Mm. He's super, super Ken. We're going to have Super Ken on the channel pretty soon, y'all. Super Pen is a renaissance man, huh? Yes, he is. <laughs> yeah, I hope you had a great week. It started off sad. But hopefully, you found some joy in these last five days. I hope you found something that made you happy and smile. How was your week? Mm -hmm. How was your week? I'm glad it's Friday. <laughs> I'm glad it's Friday. Because the teens are already restless and we just got back. Huh. You know, I think I'm gonna be in a state of mourning for a while. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was out today. I was 
listening to um Vicious song. You know, he got a song, Ball Like Kobe. So I was listening to that. Let's reminisce. These are boudin balls. They good too, man. You had they, one? Oh, God. They, they forgot to give us the sauce. I go with it. So what did a Creole woman do? She make her own sauce. She make her own. <laughs> Don't miss a beat. She make her own. Mm. <clears throat> I want to start doing time and shot. Did you bring your phone over here? Nope, I didn't. Next video, y'all. Me so, too. I, I yeah. If y'all want to start, if y'all want us to shout you out, do y'all like my sweatshirt, y'all? If y'all want to shout you out, please leave some comments down below, and we'll shout you out. Or if you have any questions, we'll answer them. Mm-hmm. Those boudin balls are good. We would love some viewer questions, too. Yeah. Ask us anything. What do you want to know about Queen Lisa? Yeah. No, you can't have our date of birth. Uh -huh. No, you can't have our social security number. <laughs> yeah. I'm not giving you my social. Lisa already got it. And that's enough. <laughs> I'm telling you. Reach over here for these coffee and sit down. Yeah, I'm sorry if y'all hit this chair. We can't get a new chair. Uh -oh. <sighs> oh, these Have you tried the crawfish? No, not, not sure. Y'all, I prefer green lip mussels over... What are they? They black lip or they just, just black? Yeah, black lip. Or black? Yeah, I prefer green. They taste to me. They seem like they to me. They taste better. I like green. Oh, this is delicious. Trying to eat my left hand. Oh, we keep bumping in each other. <clears throat> and welcome if you're new to the channel. Welcome to the fam. I think we've been getting like, <coughs> excuse me, like four or five new subscribers. Like, every once in a while. For real? Yeah. Oh, wow. Thank y'all. I could never get this little piece out of there. Lisa and showed me five million times. And I still can't get it out of there. Oh well. This is just delicious. I know I keep saying that. Mm. I didn't know what I was going to eat, but I said, mm. I'm just going to get some of my favorite things. Ooh, you wouldn't mind. Mm -hmm. It's like kick, huh? Mm-hmm. Your muscles are good, too. Yeah, you wouldn't mind. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everything has so much flavor. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Mm -hmm. <coughs> <coughs> you still ain't... Spicy? That's mild? I told them Louisiana spicy. Ooh-wee. <clears throat> they sure did. They 
and nice and red too. If you live in a Houston area, tell us some um, other coffee places to check out. Uh, Y'all, oh. excuse me. I've been having like the biggest burps. Wow. I found a new place today, but and we're gonna keep it. <clears throat> we're gonna keep it on the hush till we try it. <laughs> Cause it's not good, then I don't want you know. Mm -hmm. You know what I realized over the week? Well, yesterday, rather. That we were supposed to go to Latoya and eat crawfish when? Saturday. We were. Remember, I had tagged you in that thing. That lady was performing and stuff. Oh, why didn't we go? Well, Grayson had a, forgot. No, Grayson had a, a thing. <coughs> we probably could have went. Between that. And you had to go to the dentist. No, but we weren't going there till like, I think it started, it was like from four to eight. So after we dropped them off about a couple. Oh, oh man. That show sure wanted to get out the house. So we were supposed to go to the movies, y'all. But it was packed. Yep. It was super packed. <coughs> Oh. And they had so many teenagers out there running around. <coughs> I want some of that. <coughs> but so. we still had a good time. Ugh. Ooh. Mm. That, <coughs> that, that Louisiana spice is. And do like that. And get mm -hmm. it off. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, these muscles good. Man. Oh my god, you know who I like to watch eat muscles? Who? Oh, what's her name? Um Oh my god, what's her name? Um well the chick in Florida. Sharika. Not Sharika. No. The one that eat the muscles, the chick, I, I don't know if she's still a stripper or if she's an ex stripper. Oh, she's in, I thought she's in New York. No, she in Florida. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, God, about? why is her name Mitt? Yeah, she do. She, I she is a... I love the way yeah. she eat muscle. She I thought she eat. She is a muscle aficionado. <laughs> yeah, she do. Yeah. I mean, I do like Sharika. <laughs> Oh God! Why is her every time she posts? Why am I like this? I hate when I be talking about something I forget the name. Just, don't y'all hate that when y'all talking about something you forget the name of a place or a person? And I can't check because I don't have my phone. When y'all remember, I put it like right up in here somewhere. I'm drinking out of empty thing like that man on Tyler Perry. Uh, yeah, that be so loud when we're recording. <laughs> When you be crackling it. Oh, I'm sorry, y'all. <clears throat> Did you bring some? Oh, okay. Yeah, they did a good job on these muscles this time. They mm -hmm. really did a good job. <clears throat> did you bring me some water? Oh, it's so bad. Oh. I'm about to get some mm -hmm. water. Mm -hmm. So y'all, do y'all prefer when people talk and eat or just eat? <clears throat> I'm talking about like both, it depends on who it is. Or what they eat? Or what they eating, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> For me, it's what they eat.
How has your week been? I said your week was. It's been pretty decent, but at the beginning of the week, I said, I was Sunday. I said, I'm going to have a good, I'm going to have an awesome week this week. Other than, you know, <clears throat> other than the COVID situation, it's been good, man. And today when I was in the gym, while I was I was on the treadmill, they was they they showed Shaq, and man, just to see that big old man crying, bro, it almost I almost broke down, you know. Yeah. I almost broke down. Yeah, when people are part of your life, some kind of way. Yeah. It does. Sir. And, and you know what? Some people make me mad. They tell me you don't even you don't even know that you don't even know that man. And then it was somebody. Uh, it was somebody that was in the military that's saying y'all crying over this man and he ain't never. Did nothing <clears throat> for y'all. This that another. Well, I can I can respect whoever said that opinion. But yo, this and this 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 one of us. This is Kobe Bryant. He's a good-hearted person, a good-hearted dude, man. And he <clears throat> he played basketball. And my to me, all black people connected. <laughs> We all can. Yes, that's just my <laughs> that's just my all black people connect. So it 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 felt it hurt deep. It it hurt deep for me because I I watched him grow up from eighteen. Well, you still even watch him even now because mm -hmm. you still see him on social media and in the media with his daughter mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. you know just some different philanthropic things he does. Yeah, and, and he had a lot planned. And to go yeah. back, I can't, but I can't go back. Like now, when I see it. I have to turn it because I can't go back and I don't want to go back and watch that stuff, man, <coughs> you know? What stuff? Like his old basketball clips and stuff when he when he talking or doing the interview. I have to turn it. They showed his mom and dad today. Oh, uh, they did? They showed, um, well, I think someone had sent them some flowers. Mm. And it was outside, like, getting them or whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He looked a lot like a dad. Yeah, yep. Yeah. He look a lot like his dad. They call his daddy Jelly Bean. <laughs> yeah, that's what they said. Jelly Bean. And for a father to outlive his son, man. Yeah. And they said they had yeah. an estranged relationship, but that's yeah. it. They still mm -hmm. were family. They still act like family. I think right. it's the business side was mm -hmm. like whatever. Yeah. But yeah, he resembled his dad a whole lot. Um, mm -hmm. And I see his wife, uh, Vanessa, had her Instagram. It was private. Mm -hmm. But I see she made she it public. She opened it up. Yeah, because like, you see a lot of um, <clears throat> stuff with uh, their daughters and just different things like that. They good. <laughs> that juice. This that, is fire that, tonight. That, that gravy down up in that, that gravy, baby. Yeah, I don't know if they can oh. see it. Mm -hmm. But she uh, made her Instagram public. So I, you know, so everybody can kind of, you know. You, you're not supposed to read dip, but baby, that, I'm sorry, baby. Yeah, I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, it's mm -hmm. fine. But just so everyone can give their condolences oh. and just kind of see different things and the video she had of her daughter uh -huh. and, and uh -huh. basketball practice and playing with her friends and their bond and stuff. So, yeah. you know, I know a lot. Yeah, people saying that about you didn't know this man. Right. But you don't know a lot of people. Somebody made a good point when they asked you, well, my grandmother died. Mm -hmm. Oh, my auntie died. Somebody in your family died and they posting on social media. Mm -hmm. Y'all pray for you, pray for my family, mm -hmm. everybody giving their condolences, and mm -hmm. you know, don't nobody have nothing to say. So it's the same thing when a celebrity passes away. You know, wouldn't you think that's the same thing as far as like we don't know your grandmother and your auntie and your mom and your daddy, but we still send in prayers if you ask for them if we know mm -hmm. that you lost somebody. Right. So it's the same thing. It's just people, just haters and, and jealousy. That's to me. That's just an unhappy soul. Right. Just haters and jealousy. It's unhappy, so that's terrible. That people can be so spiteful. Mm. Yeah, but you know who that be. We ain't gotta say no name. Anything, anything dealing with us, I want to celebrate it. 
Well, we celebrated anyway. And I hope they make his image the new logo. If they do that, y'all. Uh, did you see the one that they had? Like, yeah, I like both of them. I saw two of them. And mm -hmm. if they do that, y'all, I might, I might shed a tear. And ever, and then um, they were saying, Shannon Sharp was saying that it should be Jordan. No, I rather Kobe logo than Jordan. Me too. Yeah. Yeah. I rather Kobe logo. Not to take nothing away from Jordan. No, but. of course not. But I rather Kobe logo. It's just, and you know, like you don't know the people personally, but. Mm hmm. Whatever image that he was putting out there, mm -hmm. <clears throat> I just <clears throat> I can appreciate it because mm -hmm. yeah. he come, you know, he's a family man, mm -hmm. and you know everybody have hiccups in their marriage and stuff mm -hmm. like that. But he bounced back from it. Mm -hmm. You know, he's a good husband. You know, became a good husband, father. You know, young dudes do dumb stuff. Mm -hmm. So, and I just think he's a bigger role model, right? Right. For more mm -hmm. kids than, or people uh -huh. than Michael Jordan. I could be wrong, but yeah. in mm -hmm. my opinion, uh -huh. I just feel like in current day, mm -hmm. you, he's what people want to be showing to be a good father, a good uh -huh. husband, spending right. time with your kids and mm -hmm. stuff like that. Uh -huh. <clears throat> and I'm maybe Michael Jordan might be, I'm going to get my water. Hold on, y'all. You know, Michael Jordan is probably a little more uh, maybe private mm -hmm. than Kobe and Vanessa was. Mm -hmm. But I could dig it. And to me, you know what it is? <coughs> I believe Kobe bridged that gap because he came in at 18, so he still got a chance to play with some of the older players. Mm -hmm. And then he still got a chance to play with that new generation yeah. too. So he, he really was mm -hmm. the bridge. Yeah, and, that's a good way. And a lot of people might say, well, what about Kevin Garnett? No, Kevin Garnett, I believe it was more so Kobe and Allen Iverson too, that that bridge, that, uh, that, bridge yeah. that gap yeah. between the, the old and the new. The, I guess the... the 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 eighties, nineties, and the the two thousands mm -hmm. on four. You know, one of he, the was the, he was the co bridge. Uh huh. One of the teachers at our school. I don't know if it's her jersey. Mm hmm. But she had on a authentic, like old throwback, uh -huh. Kobe jersey on wow. yesterday. I was like, oh my god! Like you can see how it's like old and worn. Uh -huh. and, mm -hmm. and she just opened the door. She was just like. Oh. Am I going? No. No. Yeah, I think this is going to be a hard one. Yeah. For everybody. Shout out, <coughs> Shout out to Kobe Bryant. I, we really had something to talk about, but I just, I'm, I just, I just had mm -hmm. to give my boy one more, one more salute. Well, hell, most of the time, we suspect people just to pass from being old. Mm -hmm. It's just some people think you're going to mm -hmm. grow old with. And he was one of those people. Mm -hmm. Come on, baby, you're crawfish. Really, really knock that back, boy. <laughs> Anything else interesting happen that you that you know of? Um, not really. To me, it's just been kind of a somber week. Yeah. I would like to address one thing if I may. Go ahead. I don't know what I'm talking about. Y'all, he keep coming out of left field on me, I swear. Terry Crews. <laughs> this is what I want to say. How your mom always tell you, if you can't say nothing nice, don't say nothing at all. I think that's advice you should have took, man. 
You should you should have took a different route than what you took. Yeah. Because she came to bat for you when you need it. But even if you didn't go to bat for her, you should have just you should have just kept it moving. Or just gave a blanketed statement. You shouldn't have. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't have said I'll what you said. I call your publicist. Right. <laughs> yeah. What should I say? Yeah. That's why you have publicists and right. agents. Yeah. Don't just. Yeah. Just don't. I don't know. Just don't leave it to your own devices. And that's what you did. You just kind of threw all her under the bus. Even if you didn't know the situation, man. You just don't comment the way you did. That. Tell them what you're talking about. Oh, okay. So if y'all don't know what I'm talking about, Gabrielle Union was on, uh, what show was that? Uh, America Got Talent? Yeah, I think, it was Amer I think it was America's Got Talent. So I never watched the show. Uh, once or twice I watched it, but I never really got into it. But Gabrielle Union was saying it was, they was racist towards her and they didn't, some, they didn't like the way she wore she was always changing her hairstyle, and they didn't like that. And so, it was kind of male chauvinistic. Right, right. So fast forward to now, Terry. Somebody asked Terry Crews about that situation with her, and he said he never experienced any racism or anything uh, to that effect. And it's, instead of him having her back with the situation, he didn't have her back. He just kind of. Threw under the bus saying, I didn't experience that. Well, okay. In my opinion, if you didn't experience that, you shouldn't have commented on that. You should have said, like I said, you should have gave a blanket statement instead of just throwing a sister under the bus. But tell him like, what he said. What he said? He said that he didn't experience that. She was talking about she experienced racism on the show. No, but also he said, didn't he say something about, I don't have to please anybody but my yeah, my but wife what? and not even my daughters. And Right. But that that's not, I don't take issue with that. That's him. The issue I take with it is that we... Look out for your sister. Right. There you go. There you go. Look out for your sister. And you didn't do that. You didn't do that now. Your daughters, <laughs> your daughters need to be mad at you for saying what you said because I'm gonna look out for mine. Everybody, you look out for your wife, yeah. your mama, your mother-in-law, uh huh, your nieces, mm -hmm. your cousins, yep, me, me, Paul, Paul. I'm looking out for everybody. Yeah, but he just is like, I mean, well, of course, the females though. That's what he was saying. Yeah, but okay, how you not look out for your daughters though? He said that was up to their husbands. Or to, or to please them. I don't know. And then Charlemagne was just saying how, you know, when you're working with working with women and you have mm -hmm. other women you, you know, mm -hmm. that you work with or be around, mm -hmm. I don't think you have to like back into there with every call because I'm the wife. Mm -hmm. Of course, I know I'm going to come first. Right. But <clears throat> I know Yaku will go out of his way to, mm -hmm. um, you know, just be helpful with women mm -hmm. and open doors right. and, you know, listen to, ask them how they doing mm -hmm. and just, you know, all those things that, you know, mm -hmm. I guess a gentleman would do or whatever. Mm -hmm. But just, I don't know. It almost sounded like a he didn't care. like a wussy statement. It's like he a wussy. He didn't care. I just, and I don't like movie. Terry Crews. Uh -huh. Now I don't know. This is Hollywood, y'all. Uh -huh. So I don't know if when he made the statement about the agent or whoever it was that felt him up mm -hmm. at the party, if he mm -hmm. got some backlash mm -hmm. from that. So maybe his maybe his agents were like. You're not getting work mm -hmm. as much as you used to. I don't know, or, or you know, work is slowing down, so you need to just kind of mm -hmm. hush, mm -hmm. you know, because before you get blackballed. Well, he already on it. He, he before on a you get show. blackballed mm -hmm. in uh, Hollywood, so maybe maybe they told him like you need to kind of like chill out. I don't know. 
Yeah, but okay. If they but told you see him, what I'm saying? yeah, just, but if they told him he needed to chill out, he should have stayed away from that question. And well, not again, needed, that's you know, why you have an agent and a publicist. Well, he should have stayed away from that question because he jumped right in the song. Them 10, 15, 20 percent that you pay in these people, that's what you have them there for. Well, he jumped right in the sauce, and it just it wasn't it wasn't. <coughs> It wasn't necessary. And uh, and back to what you said about me being helpful towards women and stuff like that. I give you, I tell you a quick little story. One day, me and Lisa was coming in the house and our neighbor, she was going somewhere. Now we see this woman. She always got her work clothes on. She always be that working. Be working, bro. Always be working. When I when she I leave working. out in the morning early, she leaving out in the morning early. And then when I'm coming home late, she coming home. <clears throat> Sometimes she leaving back out. And is that her mom? So, yeah, yeah. So one day, a couple of days ago, she was dressed nice and everything. And I was like, I said, hey, where you going? You got a date? And Lisa laughed and say, you shouldn't have said it like that. I said, well, I ain't want to tell her you she looked nice. For you. I ain't want to make you mad. She said, no, that wouldn't have made me mad. She said, I she do look nice. She did look nice. Yeah. So I'm not uh, a hater. Right. And no, it's not about you mm -mm. being a hater, but that's me respecting. That's me. Yeah, but if I feel know, a lady look nice, mm -hmm. tell her, if you think of somebody yeah. look nice, look nice. That don't mean yeah. like in an appropriate <laughs> way or something. Yeah. And and that's what's missing with us. Okay, now we bring them back around. <laughs> that's what we missing as a community, as a family. Just men helping women. That's not your woman. Help a sister out sometime. And protect the black yeah. people, man. Or, or stand up for a sister, man. You can't be... They, by him doing that, that that opened up the floodgates for people to be disrespectful. Looking at her to, crazy. Right, disrespectful towards her. But, I mean, thank God she got Dwayne Wade. Well, you know. Gabrielle Union... <laughs> Oh, it's her me. own woman. Right. She's not one to shy away from a conversation. She's going to tell you how it is and what it is. And, um, you know, a lot of women, a lot of women aren't like that. Mm -hmm. And a lot of times black women have to, um, how can I say this? <laughs> a lot of time we have to. When we express ourselves, people take it the wrong way. <coughs> Bless you. A lot of times people take it the wrong way. <clears throat> but we just saying how we feel without having to make somebody else feel comfortable, mm -hmm. you know, when you're in our space. Mm -hmm. So I just said it the way that I said it. And, you know, mm -hmm. and a lot of times people don't like when a black woman is outspoken. Or whatever. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. You know, uh, I'm going to know what his wife thought about that. Mm. Well, I think she was on his side because from the initial conversation, that's why he made the, <coughs> he made the statement. Yeah. Yeah, because I mean, you would talk to your spouse before you go out here. And start I would think you would, but I don't being think being reckless you, at I, the I, mouth. I, I would think you would, but I don't know. I don't know if this was an on the spot question for him, but I'm sure they had had dialogue about it before. But I think that I the, would think so. I think the person that interviewed him just asked him that on the spot. I just don't like his answer, man. I mean, I don't know all the details, and I don't care. I just don't like the fact of. How he answered the question. Yeah. He couldn't yeah. he could have did a better job. Cause all the all the all the powers that be need is just a little crack to see it's not unified. And mm -hmm. they going in. Yeah. And that's that's, true. that's the problem. And he gave it to him. Right, he, he did. He did, but he did that. But he gave him the opportunity to <coughs> try to divide con divide and conquer. But Steven Jackson came back and said, call him a Call him a clown. Say we standing with Dwayne Wade and Gabrielle. So yeah. she got back. She got back it. And I mean, I don't see where she would lie. Like, why would you lie about something like no. that? When you don't have to. Like, you don't necessarily need. 
Oh, uh, America's <coughs> Got Talent. She don't need none of that. <laughs> yeah, you, you don't necessarily need that. That ain't like your, that's you depend on that for your livelihood. Yeah, she got a whole other, she got other mm -hmm. stuff going on. She enjoyed doing the show. Yeah. So. Mm. But, no. and that's for other men, mm -hmm. specifically black men. Mm -hmm. Which, I mean, he probably don't live in that space anyway. He probably don't live in like a maybe a black community type mm -hmm. space mm -hmm. where he got like, and I don't know, but mm -hmm. I would think that maybe other men would start looking at him, but black men like, I think they've been. Look, I think they. <laughs> I think they've been looking at him like that. Well, I know they started ripping him apart mm -hmm. when he was saying that he was the guy had groped him or whatever. Because mm -hmm. <clears throat> my brother was like, he got beat up. <laughs> my brother would have been like, we'd have turned that party smooth the hell up. And if you're not gonna beat him up, do something, man. Press charges or something. Don't just let you you. Don't just let him grab you. Grab your wahoo. Yeah. <laughs> you and just, go on he, about your business. You just grab your drunk. He just grab your junk and you just, you know, you say you got angry. No, that's assault. That is assault, right? That's assault. Yeah. Because if that was him, we'd have had to get him out of jail. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys, your wife's, would have had to go and get you out of jail. Grabbing him. Yeah, he grabbed. Like, come on, man. Just. Oh, well, let's, yeah. let's oh. just do better by our women. I yeah. try. I I make it a gallant effort every day. You're right, baby. This is to, delicious. Go ahead. Is, I make it a gallant effort every day to do better by my wife and other black women. Whether it be saying hello in the morning, give them a compliment, or just walking by them and kind of giving them a smile. And I just, me mugging, hating the world. Oh, we got to do better, man, because I, I at, at this point, our women don't trust us no more. That's why they go in other places to find love. That's why <clears throat> they self-hate. That's why we getting all these Instagram, Instagram models and thoughts getting all these <laughs> fake booties and stuff like that. that was, back in the days, they, yo, like. Yeah, back in the days, we ain't had none of that. All this fakery and all this, this... little baby crawfish. I'm listening to talk. All this, all this fake butts and stuff, man. We didn't have all that back in the day. And I'm not trying to be old school or go old school on nobody. Let's just get back to... Let's just get back to loving Being our women. Being some Right, yeah. Taking care of women. Mm-hmm. And if I haven't done something like I'm supposed to do, I'm sorry. I'm going to do better. Y'all heard it here first. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I make sure every day. I don't let a day go by. I don't compliment my wife. Even when she had made me mad. <coughs> I still compliment her. Then you know, you have like, why do you have like, you have a mom, you have a, he has a mom, he has maybe sisters or cousins or uh -huh. female, other females in his family, mm -hmm. so, yeah, <sighs> that ain't how you, go ahead, <laughs> no, bro. I'm good. <coughs> I was going to stick my hand back in there, I'm not going to do it's it. It's a muscle. Oh, my God. God. I'm full, but they taste, y'all, when I tell y'all. They do taste good. They taste, they taste so good, and it's. Like, can we can we keep this little these drippings? No, we mm. have no reason to keep muscle Man. drippings. Oh my God, this this. Mm. Woo. Oh, hold on, y'all. Yeah, I had to re reset the camera, y'all. The battery is about to. <laughs> we, we had some technical difficulties. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, are you done? Um. Done. I'm not finished eating, but I'm done. I should. This was eating. good. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. a good meal. Yeah. So this is going up Friday. Yeah. Man, it was a good meal. We might throw an extra one up because it's still early in the week. Yeah. I'm still trying to work on that little piece. I showed you how to do it. I know, but I can't. Take the, I know. Babe, just take it and scrape it. Y'all, and I had to go to dentist today. You really? Oh God! Oh, I hate that sound. Mm-hmm. It was. 
All right, y'all. Well, I think we are done. Thank you so much for eating with us. Let us know what you had. <coughs> if you ate anything with us. Do you have any last words? Uh, no, I don't have no last words. I'm, <laughs> I'm not going nowhere. Do you have anything else to say? Yes, I do. Oh, you want me to say it now? What you mean say it now? What? I, that's why I just asked it. Oh, in closing, my thoughts are, like I said, if you don't have nothing nice to say, don't say nothing at all. And if you don't have nothing nice to tweet, shut your tweet up. Bam. All right, y'all, we out of here. He acting like he was drinking vodka. I'm, I'm, dr I'm, I'm drunk full. I'm really drunk full right now. Drunk full. That mean I ate a lot of food and I'm just a little loopy. You food wasted? Yeah, that's the good that's one. That's food. He's I'm food still, wasted. I'm food wasted, y'all. I'm like seriously food <coughs> wasted. All right, y'all, before he gets there, anything else that just is Can you crazy. drive like that? Drive food wasted? That's, can they, will they pull you over for being food wasted? He just made me tired. Like, he just took the last one that I had for the day. I think he just took it out of my body. Well, we got to tell him what to do. All right, y'all. We gone. Don't forget to feed your, your soul. soul. Bye, y'all. Why don't you? Crazy. What the heck? It's probably just floating in there. Oh, Didn't there it have a loose one in there? There it go. Look at that. Look at he. Oh, it's been marinating too, y'all. Oh. Look at that. Look at that. I got it. I, I'm good. I'm Gucci. Look at that. That do taste good. They, they good tonight. You want to have some? Mm -mm, there's another one in there. Yeah, I'm going to eat that one too. Whatever. Mm. It's like they let these sit for a little while. Well, I didn't pick them up. Oh, um, so I got the Quick. juices. Yeah, because every time I get there, mm. I hate having to, like, wait. Mm -hmm. And I thought it would have been packed tonight, but y'all had maybe about 12, 15 people in there, something what like that. Well, no, just, I, don't, yeah. I don't think nobody... Well, ain't nothing popping tonight. Yeah, ain't no good games popping in there tonight, you know. Yeah. Uh, Super Bowl this weekend, though, boy. Everybody in morning. But Shaq was like, he was like, I don't know. Because I think he got a party. Yeah, he said he's going to give the proceeds to the families. Yeah, that's good. That's involved in the, uh, yeah. <coughs> that was involved in the accident.